I'm glad I'm fishing only the left hand bank because uh, it looks pretty expensive to get across on the ferry. Well, I've arrived at Lower Schoon for the day. It looks pretty good. The water's really low, but uh, it's not far from the tidal water. So I've got all my gear set up, ready to go. All I really need now is some fish in the water. So I'll go and have a wee splash about the top of the beach, right just above the hut there. So I'll go in up there and fish my way down. See if I can splash about right up at the top of the beach, stand in the croy. Have a wee shot here in the faster water before I work my way down. Uh, I won't be able to cover all the water, but I think I'll have fun trying. I've got in a wee usual to send it out for this one. I was talking to Harry the Gilly, who's uh, said that the best chance of a fish is away down over here. I was away up above the hut, which is right away up at the corner there. But he said to come down here and have a shot. He said, really good fly water. All the fish have got to come through this bit here. So I'll just get myself in here and have a wee cast or two and work my way down. As Harry said, most of the fish have got to come through this section here because it's that shallow further over. So hopefully anything flying through here will uh, attack my fly. Well, will actually rain on as predicted. Only trouble is it's come a wee bit earlier than it was supposed to. Won't affect me today because I've got my jacket for a change. Pleasant walk back up to the car. Uh, can't see any fish splashing from here looking at the beat. Looks really nice. Uh, Harry said to get in the water there, way down to your, to your uh, belly button or as near as possible and fish it down. So there's uh, a good chance round about that stone. I'm in the water, I haven't seen anything yet, but uh, definitely looks fishy. Strange I haven't seen any trout either. Quite a few, few flies hatching. The gulls appear to be getting them all. 28 minutes past 12, and all the fish should be arriving shortly. But, uh, so far, nothing.
I fished down from the fast water all the way down past the rock but I uh, haven't seen anything or touched anything so I'm going to go for my lunch well back into the water again see if there's anything happening so it seems to be a severe lack of salmon again this year I think a lot of them are getting caught up with disease off the the fish farms, the escapees from the fish farms. If anybody wants, they could have a look at a video called Salmon Confidential. It's about the salmon farming industry in Canada and how it's decimated their their salmon, their wild salmon stocks through disease. So. Uh, I think it's possibly the same thing that's happening to our Scottish salmon and uh, our uh, salmon farming industry are self-regulating and they're not giving two hoots about the wild salmon. So the more people that have a look at this video, Salmon Confidential, and uh, if you look at the, the salmon that you see in the supermarkets that are getting sold, and some of them are reduced because they look like eels and obviously diseased. And that disease, I'm sure, must be spreading to our wild stock, to where the escapees, and they, they're obviously dying somewhere because there's a lot of smokes going back to sea, but they're just not coming back to the rivers. So it's worthwhile having a look at it. The video's called Salmon Confidential. I really appreciate it if you have a look at it. Just saw a wee sea trout splash just off that boulder. It looked like it had been in for a wee while. Probably a fish about a pound and a half. If anybody's lost their old spinning reel, uh, I think I've found it. But uh, I think the bale arm's missing and a couple of other bits have had it. So I'll just leave it lying here and if it is yours and you want it, you can come down to the bottom of the walk mill and collect it. That's me back in the water. I had to go and change the, the battery in the camera. So, I'm all prepared, just in case I catch a fish. Changed my line for the last half hour, three quarters of an hour, just so that I can work the, the fly. I've put in a shooting head and see if I can bring it through the water and be able to cast that wee bit further as well. Still haven't seen anything apart from swallowed sand martens and gulls. There's a wee sea trout there just Came right out the water. It uh, looked like it had been in for a wee while.
Well, this is the last cast. Time to go home for something to eat. And with it being Saturday, a wee glass of red wine. So, just have to get ready and organised and look forward to the next trip. It's been a lovely day though, even although it's been raining. Nice bit to fish. Just shame about me not catching. But that's fishing.